Into your hands we commit the people of Tunisia. Lord God, we are most grateful for them. We pray asking you to continuously guide and protect them. Father, Lord God, we pray that they may come to see your saving power in their lives. For many of them may be Muslims, but today cause a turnaround point where they shall come to see and realize your love for them. We pray asking you to let them share in your love, let them be partakers of your love so that they may not go back to their former religions. Father Lord God, we pray asking you that they may grow economically for your word says that you wish that we may prosper. Father Lord God, we know that poverty is not their portion and therefore we pray against it in the name of Jesus. We commit every disease on the land of Tunisia into your hands and ask that you Lord God shall free them from all poverty, you shall free them from all diseases. Father Lord God, we also pray committing their leaders in your hands that it is you that elects leaders. We also pray that you God shall direct them. Let them be able to take decisions in your light. Father Lord God, we pray that your love will forever remain with them. They shall never continue to sin and they shall be redeemed for you. We pray for the churches in Tunisia that they shall continue to grow in your love and in your unity. We pray for an expansion in the Christian churches too. We pray that there shall be more missionaries to do your work, to carry out your work in the land of Tunisia. We pray asking that the Holy Spirit shall always be with them in all that they do. As they move on in life, O oh God, they shall never forget you. We commit the youth into your hands, that they shall be able to remember you in their youthful days, so that they may be able to carry out the good works that you have planned for their lives. In the mighty name of Jesus, we pray with thanksgiving. Amen.